So in this video I'm gonna show you how to create this anime effect and uh, you can actually make the same bird by following my previous tutorial videos or you can download it on my Patreon page. And please don't freak out, I'm gonna pass the microphone to my British cousin. Let's create a new material. Open up another tab and switch to shader editor. Add the following nodes. Switch to render mode and add a light by pressing shift and A. Adjust the color ramp until you get this cell shaded look. Start with the backlight. Feel free to copy the same light object settings. Duplicate the light with Shift D to add a smoke light. For the first keyframe, type in 0 and right click to add the keyframe. Do the same for remaining keyframes. If you have the same character, parent the smoke light to the head bone. Go to the materials tab and add a bunch of materials so you can have a color variety for your character. Go to the edit mode and select faces you want to have in a different color. Select the material and press the assign button. Turn on flat shading and go to the materials tab. Under the viewport display, select the color for each material. For the eye pupils, make sure you make all the colors in the color ramp black as well.
Now, when the character is fully colored, and the lights are set up, it's time to add freestyle line work to our character. Make sure you have the same settings. Go to the edit mode and add some more lines by selecting edges and marking freestyle edges. Add camera and position it by pressing N and selecting this checkbox. Make sure you have transparency selected under the film tab. Select the workbench renderer and render settings. Create a folder for the colors, and make sure you have PNG with RGBA selected in the output settings. Render it out. Switch back to EV, and make another folder for the backlight. Make sure the render icon is selected only for the backlight. Make another folder for the smoke light, and do the same. For shadows, we will need to select shadows and backlight lights, and add freestyle option. Go to the world settings, and make the color white, and create another folder for the lines. Create a new composition with 24 frames per second. Start by importing color image sequences, and then proceed to add all the other sequences. Double click the rectangle icon to add a background color.
press T to change the shadow opacity. Right click all the sequences and change the frame rate to 12 frames per second. And that's that for the anim effect itself. You can do much more by adding all kinds of color filters and effects. Once more, access the rigged character, tutorial files and bonus content by supporting me on my Patreon. Thanks so much for watching, bye bye.